YouTubers! What's up? Damn, this weather is nice. Fresh. Cloudy. I love this trailer. Especially when I'm riding. There's no better weather than this. Except the lady that's in front of me and is not driving up to the speed limit. I thought it was a lady, it's a motherfucker. I would have thought it was a lady because normally ladies are the ones that drive very slow. Uh. So anyway, I want to talk to you guys about Allergies and writing. Recently, a few days ago, I got an allergic reaction to bee sting. And I did know I was allergic, but I wasn't uh, in a well knowledge of how severe my allergy was to bee things. And also that it, it's her hereditary, it's just like, fuck man, if my dad or my mom had it, I'm going to have it. Maybe even my kids are going to have it. It sucks. So, what happened was that I was riding home from work, relaxed, wearing, wearing this gear that I'm actually wearing. My knee pads, my chest, vest. And I was riding home, relaxed like nothing. And now all of a sudden, BAM! I feel something in my chest. And it feels fucking hot. And now my first thought was like, fuck. The fucking driver in front of me must have thrown his fucking cigarette butt out the window. Which here in Mexico, it's, it's illegal to litter, but cops don't care about it. You can be smoking and you can throw your cigarette butt out the window. Which is bad. Really bad. So I feel like something's fucking burning in my chest. Right below the helmet. So I feel something hot and I start like smacking it to see if it moves to another place or something like that. You know. Trying to move the heat away from main spot where I'm burning and I start moving around and I'm still feeling hot but I mean like burning hot like something like a red piece of metal just fell upon me and I was like fuck man this shit is not coming down and I didn't stop the check because the heat started going down. I started feeling like really uncomfortable in that area. Which right now where there's dirt roads, it fucking bothers me because it's hitting, little pebbles are hitting my neck. And my skin right now is fucking irritated as fuck due to the fucking base thing. So I get with my buddies, I start drinking some whiskeys, and 
The feeling goes away for the rest of the night until next day when I have to go to the office. I go to the office. I start feeling my skin all irritated in that area like like if I got a, uh, a severe sunburn. And I'm like, what the fuck? So I look at it and I'm like, damn. That shit is red, like sunburnt red. Or like a burnt. Then all of a sudden I start feeling... I start feeling numbness. Numbness on my skin. Numbness on my arms. My legs start cramping. Uh, start feeling really sleepy. So I was like, fuck it, you know what? I'm feeling weird. Let's go check, get checked up by the, uh, the company's doctor. So I tell him my symptoms and he's like, yup. You got a bee sting, and you're allergic. He's like, I can't believe that you're still standing, man. You're fucking allergic, and you're still standing. He's like, go get yourself treated right away. So I go get myself treated. And... I get have to get injected in the morning and at night so the fucking meds are also fucking killing me not like killing me killing me but they're making me really drowsy Right now, the injection that I got in the morning has worn off, so I don't feel that drowsy, but man, this morning, I felt like I was fucking riding drunk. Seriously, the effect was like being drunk, and I was like, God damn, this is not safe. I gotta slow down, take it easy. So I start, I'm still going to work, I had to go to work because I left a lot of pending zoom the day before to get myself attended. I feel like shit. I feel like shit. I get to the office and I think it was because I was also exposed to the sun. The doctor never told me to stay away from the sun. So, while I was riding, I was getting hit by the sun, and it was accelerating the medication and all that shit, and I was like, oh, fuck, man. So, I get home. I'm sorry, I get to the office and I'm like, oh, fucking A, man. Excuse me. I think there was an accident. Oh, my. Yeah, there was a pretty bad accident. Um. I get to the office and one of my co-workers he's like dude what the fuck are you doing here I'm like I'm here to work man he's like man you look worse than what you looked yesterday what the fuck are you doing here and I'm like serious he's like yeah man I he's like seriously you look like shit like you hadn't slept in a while you look all fucked up and I'm like Ah, oh, man, I don't know, man. Let, let's, uh, I told him, like, uh, give it some time and see if, if, if I cool down. 
maybe it was the heat and it brought me a little bit more down than before. He's like, sure. He's like, but if whatever you feel, man, if you don't feel any good, just let me know. He's like, because he's like, he was like, oh fuck, man. You seriously look really bad. So he's like, he was telling me, oh, I don't want to, I don't want to see you collapse in the office. I don't want that shit happening in the office. So I'm like, I know, I know. But I'll let you know if I'm feeling bad or if I need to leave the bike at the office and, and go home or get attended or whatever. So again, I call the doctor and he's like, yeah, you, you need to rest. Uh, this shit is going to hit you hard. You're very susceptible to, to bee sting. So go rest, buddy. So what I did is I took some time to relax and I started feeling a little bit better. The only thing that's really, really hitting me hard is the skin. Feels like a mosquito bite all over, man. Itches like crazy. So yeah, I started feeling better. But man, if you're allergic, if you're allergic to bees or allergic to something, it feels really awful to ride with the allergy taking effect. I don't recommend it for anyone. So if you don't know if you're allergic to bees, go ahead and do it because it's something that I had forgotten to contemplate while I'm writing. Because it was long back when I got checked for allergies. And just to see that this shit happened to me, it is not funny. And all of this happened while I was on the bike. I got stung by being on the bike. I got to feel all doped up in the bike. A bunch of shit, man. But, the good thing about it is that the fresh air hitting me, man, is really, really good. So, yep. And I hope I feel better tomorrow morning because we're going to Morelia to celebrate Moto Club's anniversary in Morelia, Michoacan. So, the cameras are going to be ready. Everything's going to be ready. Everything's going to be packed before today, before the day's over today. In Boogie de Morelia. Yup, yup, yup. Well, I think that's all I wanted to talk to you guys about. I hope you guys have a good weekend. Enjoy it. And I'll see you next week. Peace.